Jared Leonard, tourist to Tony. Welcome to my crib. So this is the living room. This is where we do all the hanging out. This is actually pretty cool. This is a, a original Julius Caesar head um, that these guys um, dug up in Colombia years ago. So this is really important to this house that kind of brings the whole living room together, as you kind of see. Sometimes I just like to look sit around and, and you know make like uh, just like origami uh, it's, a, it's a super passion of mine so I'll sit here and you know talk with everybody and kind of do some origami and just discuss certain things and politics and economics and all that stuff it's really it's everything that goes on right here So this is really where you can come and like just, I like to sit out here, put my seat up. It's a little wet right now, it kind of rained today, but I like to pull the seat up and just kind of sit out and watch everything. One of the highlights of the whole spot is we got a pretty kick-ass uh, avocado tree. This is actually a real avocado tree. Uh, it, they won't be ready for about four or five years, but it's in the making, and uh, they, you know, I have some pretty good, at least two or three avocados a year from this thing, which is pretty sweet. Welcome to my kitchen. Come on, take a look. Check out the fridge. Show you guys the fridge, what I got in my, my cabinets. Um, this is really everything. I mean, we got some fresh strawberries here from, from the market. Gosh, they are amazing, really good. And a lot of people like talk about the champagne and everything in their fridge, and you gotta have that, but. I mean, if you don't have milk in a bag in, uh, in Argentina, you're not really doing it, you're not balling. So get your milk, let you in a bag, that's where it's at. And then you get these cute little containers to, to put them into. Boom. Got yourself some fresh milk. Mmm. That's good. You know you're doing it when you're drinking milk out of a bag. Mmm. That's good. You know you're doing it when you're drinking milk out of a bag. So we got that, we got some, yesterday we got some rice left over from yesterday. No, it's not very good at all. <laughs> Everything like that. Also, this is like where we do our microwaving. We like to kind of do both in one. The washer really doesn't work right now. We just kind of keep um, keep it for storage. Really is the best thing for it. Uh, but but the dryer works. Um, the dryer works pretty good actually. It only takes a few days to dry everything out, and they come out smelling just like whatever you microwaved. So that's really good. Um, and come on back here. I'll show you a little secret. This is the second bathroom. Um, this is where we. This is where I like to go for what I like to call the empanada emergencies. Um, this is where I come and hide out if, uh, if I don't want to go to the other bathroom, which is a lot more social. This is my bedroom. Come on in, take a look. I'm going to show you guys the most important thing in this room, the best thing that I really love, and that's, uh, this is my state-of-the-art remote control, um, 
Yeah, you might say it's maybe a little bit bigger than average. You say, uh, Gareth, you know, can you can you control the lights and the, the fan and everything with this remote? No, no, I can't. I, I control the volume and, and the channels. Um, but it's nice because a lot of people in there, your fancy high-tech uh, remote controls, they can sometimes trip on the keypads, but with me, I have to put my whole hand on the number for it to work, so you know you never mess up and you always get the channel that you want, so it's pretty solid, good remote control to have. Come out here this summer. Hopefully, this will be a kicking spot. Maybe we're gonna get like a little kiddie pool and a barbecue, so we can do some asado up here. And this is it, man. This is the view. This is the view from the top, top of the world. Well, actually, that I guess that would be more of the top of the world. All right. Now I'm gonna show you guys. Check out my whips. Um, where I get around the city. This one comes, I'm going to show you guys it. 152, that's my favorite ride. I guess if I had to pick one ride, that would be it, 152. Um, other rides, Radio Taxi, I like to take that sometimes. Um, 68 is a good one. One off, so that's pretty good. Um, radio Taxis, the soup day I take too, I'll show you guys that sometime. Um, but this is the most important thing, though. those are my rides. Right now, um, get ready for lunch, go to Great Avenue, you saw my ride, you saw my house, you saw the roof. I mean, you really got all that. My whole pad, everything that I do here in Buenos Aires, so with all that being said, I'm gonna go grab some vegetables for lunch. Ciao. Se fue levantando polvo, dejó el barrio de barracas.